is a peer theater outreach health education program addressing behaviors that place adolescents and their families at risk for HIV and a host of critical health and social problems. I didn't see you standing that time, yo, for Adidas. Yo, where'd you get those hotkicks.com? More like notkicks.com. <laughs> for over 21 years, Nightstar's evidence-based performing arts program has imparted vital health messages to over 2 million adolescents, their caregivers, and providers. I've learned through Nightstar that it's always good to talk to someone about it and not really keep your feelings inside of you and really and not fall you know like not fall peer pressure and stuff like that because that can affect you later on. It's good to learn while you're young because if you're when you get older you may not have a chance to learn about the stuff until like you're actually faced with it. And then like once you get there it's like wow. Using theater as a tool for education, abstinence and family communication is promoted to fifth and sixth graders while prevention of risky sexual activities, violence, and substance abuse is ingrained in programs for seventh graders through college-age youth. Well, it creates an environment for the kids that they can be very comfortable in to learn about sex and all the peer pressure that they're experiencing in puberty. And they, they become very relaxed and they ask questions that I don't think they would normally ask. And yeah, I think it's a fantastic program. I'm jealous I didn't have it when I was growing up. <laughs> parents are benefiting too. Many caregivers in these communities were teen parents and victims of violence. So Nightstar helps them to learn appropriate behaviors to address with their children. Nightstar engages people in a way that's extremely significant because it entertains them, it connects them, it speaks to them, not at them. And when they're engaged like that, they're much more likely to hear the message that you have to say. We talk about puberty and all the topics around that, such as pregnancy and anatomy, sexual abuse, HIV 101, and this is all done through characters. Each character has their own issue and they see a different scene about that topic. And then we discuss the topics with the characters. By allowing youth to explore the questions and practice the strategies that lead to healthier lifestyles and reduced perilous behaviors, Nightstar is saving the lives of hundreds of youth each year. I started Nightstar in 1987 at the height of the HIV epidemic amongst teenagers when nobody was recognizing that teenagers were at risk. Using a theatrical format, which we call edutainment, is extremely important because it allows young people to learn without feeling like they're being preached at. So they're used to TV, they're used to YouTube, they're used to entertaining formats and we felt that this was the best way to bring this kind of vital information to them. 